Commuting and computing can cause major back pain. So how do you deal with that pain? What do you do to get better? Dr. Jeff is in with some ideas for strengthening our backs. And we work at a computer all day. We kind of are hunching over. Um, if, we're, if we're driving or we're passengers, we're slouched over, fix us, Dr. Jeff. This is one of those segments where everybody, you can just feel them all sitting up I straight. Know. Kicking their head back a little bit. <laughs> so every time we talk about something like this, it always sounds silly. One of the very first things is before you go traveling uh, or sitting for a long time, certainly driving for long distances, always stretch before you drive and get out and stretch a little bit after you drive. Really? Doesn't like what kind of stretching are you doing before you're driving? Well, you got to stretch the hammies, doing some calf <laughs> stretches up against the wall at the gas yeah. station or, or uh, uh, something like that. Also, uh, this isn't in here, but uh, I tell people, especially if they've got low back pain, make sure that it, you don't have to set a time record, you know, a land speed record to get where you're going, yeah. which we always try to do. Uh, but get out and, and just walk around for about five minutes once every hour or so. Oh, that's hard for me to do. Because I'm one of those land speed guys. I, I sit there and I'm like, all right, we're going to Austin. If I can do this and that. All right, girls, we're going to go potty one time. Right. You guys make sure you do it quickly and let's get on the road. But we need to just slow down a little bit. Absolutely. My okay. wife calls it Iron Man in it. And I don't, I'm like, no, let's just... Uh, Take your time and stretch a little bit. And then just roll those back and shoulders. Get it all loosened up. And yeah, make sure you're driving in the correct position as well. Ear holes above your shoulders. Okay. We'll shoulders right above your hips. Okay. And your knees, if possible, just a little bit higher than your hips. Okay. Yeah. Some of those new fancy cars, you can hit the button and it'll raise your knees exactly. up a little bit. Exactly. That's a fancy car for you. All right. Now at the office, help me out because that's where I spend a lot of my time in there typing at the computer screen. Sure. Um, help me out. Well, you want to make sure that your chair has some lumbar support. I think None. most people I have zero. are. I zero. <laughs> Maybe most people yeah. aren't on board with that. You want to make sure that you have, and this goes for driving too, you have both feet firmly planted instead of crossing or anything okay. like that. Firmly planted on the ground so that it doesn't start messing with your hips or your low back. Um, you want to make sure that your keyboard is at an ideal level. You'd like for your forearms to be somewhat horizontal to the ground. Okay. Um, you'd like for your monitor to be right at eye level. What they've really noticed is your postural muscles will respond to whether you're either f too far forward or you're too far backwards. Same thing goes with your head. If you're carrying it too far forward or too far backwards, you start to create strain that over time start to affect you eventually. I may need a couple more phone books to get it up to the height that I need. <laughs> All right, yeah. Jeff, what else do you have for us? <laughs> well, th I mean, that's pretty much it. Make sure that you stretch. Make sure that you take breaks. You can also, um, if you're starting to feel a little bit stiff in the shoulders, you can roll them. You can, you can, you know, stick your chest way out and shrug your shoulders and just do some gentle stretches yeah. and try to, just try not to, what they realize is that movement is healing. Yeah. If you're just sitting there you're in like trouble. a lump on a log, then yeah. you need to move. So if, if you're going on that road trip this summer, take some time, get out, smell the roses, walk around a little bit, and don't try to uh, set a record. Dr. Jeff, thank you for being here. If you get back and you're a little sore off that road trip, you can call our friends over at Creekstone Integrated Care. They can get you taken care of. They can also walk you through all the insurance options. There's so many things when it comes to chiropractic care. I hope you give them a call uh, so that way you can be in the know. We've got a spa with massage therapists. We can handle it. I know. I just went over there for a massage the other day. <laughs> we appreciate it. it. I, I'm surprised they got me out of there. Coming up next with recent.